I have fought the good fight. I have finished the race. I have kept the faith. These are words that I would like to be able to confidently say when death is knocking at my door. And on this channel, we've talked about why we need to give our all while we have the chance. And I'll link that video above so you can take a look. We've also reflected on the life of John Lewis, who passed earlier in 2020. We've also reflected on the life of Chadwick Boseman, who also passed in 2020. And we have looked at how their lives could continue to serve as inspiration for us to continue to grow and to continue to pursue the things that we need to pursue. We've talked about purpose. We've talked about the fact that we've been called to be a light. Today, I want us to talk about what and who we are fighting for, as well as how we are fighting. The late Ruth Bader Ginsburg was quoted saying, fight for the things that you care about, but do it in a way that will lead others to join you. And so I ask, what are you fighting for? And if you are not fighting for anything, might I gently say that you might not be living the way you should be? I'll ask, who are you fighting for? And again, if you're not fighting for anyone, you perhaps are not loving in the way that God has called you to love. And then thirdly, I want to ask you, how are you fighting? She said, fight for the things that you care about, but do it in a way that will lead others to join you. She also said, this is how she would like to be remembered. She'd like to be remembered as someone who used whatever talent she had to do her work to the best of her ability and to help repair tears in her society to make things a little better through the use of whatever ability she has. To do something, as her colleague David Souter would say, outside of herself. How would you like to be remembered? Will you be able to look back at your life and say, I have fought the good fight. I have finished the race. I have kept the faith. Will others reflect on your life and say, she used her light. She used her light so others could see, so others could walk, so others could dream. She used her light to make her world a better place. I encourage you today to take a moment to think about what you are fighting for, who you are fighting for, and how you are fighting. Reflect on the goals that you've set for your life and whether you need to set new ones, set bigger ones, or to just continue working towards them. And I encourage you to fight the good fight, to give your all, and to finish your race. I pray as usual that you will have a blessed and a very productive day. Please take a moment to hit the like button below and to drop a comment down below letting me know if you enjoyed this content. Until next time, continue to breathe and to bloom and stay tuned for more content about all things growth. Take care.